that you want to stretch and put your foot across just above your knee like this. And so it's kind of making a figure four position right there. So keep your back straight and you can do either way to stretch. You can take the other foot and slide it up towards you and you should feel that stretch in that piriformis area right there. Or you can just bring your whole body up, but at your hips, try, you know, try not to curl your back because then you're not getting much of a stretch, but keep that back straight and then just lean forward at your hips. And I'm feeling a really good stretch right through my piriformis right there. So again, just holding it for about 30 seconds and then doing that three times. Again, I would do both sides just to kind of get everything nice and loosened up. So then the next one is going to be a hip flexor stretch because again, that we're just kind of working all those muscles around the hips to get that tightness out of there. Again, there's a bunch of different ways you can stretch the hip flexors. The best way I like to do it is kind of getting in a lunge position. So make sure you're protecting your knees while you're doing that. So when you get